Shinta, I'm proud of your scores on the test from the other day. You had the highest score in the whole class. Good work. Thank you so much. However, there's just one thing I'm worried about. You're always alone. <laughs> My name is Sinta. I'm a junior. I'm 156 centimeters and weigh 47 kilos. I have zero friends. I never have any problems with other people, although my life is plain and ordinary. I'm content with my life. None of the emotional roller coaster stuff that kids my age go through. Oh my gosh, so you know my Madoka? Who is Madoka? She's won the school beauty pageant, although she's only a sophomore. She has over 300,000 followers, and everybody knows her name. She's famous. She has a porcelain face with sweet eyes, and her body is perfectly proportioned. Some guys from an entertainment agency came to see me yesterday. They want me to become famous. Wow! She looks just like a doll. I live in a completely different world than her. I knew we would never cross paths even if we went to the same school. However... Gosh, Madoka has the highest scores out of all the students in our class. Impressive! Is there anything she can't do? Hey guys, do you know who this Shinta guy is? Shinta? Oh yeah, he's always second. I wonder who he is. Oh, him. He's in our class, but he doesn't have much of a presence. I see. She's always surrounded by friends, and she does after-school activities. But she always comes in first place. On the other hand, I'm friendless and spend all my days studying. And I'm still second. Why don't you show me your taka style dancing? You're a loser, you can do it, right? I even brought these glow-in-the-dark sticks for you! Madoka goes out of her way to pick on me. <laughs> Madoka, that is so kind of you! Yo, don't keep Madoka waiting! Get on with it! <laughs> uh, I guess she had her reasons. <laughs> Look at him! I'm taking a video of you right now. I'll make sure to upload it on MoneyTube. I said I'm recording. Smile, will you? Ew, you have the creepiest laugh. I thought this would continue until the day I graduate. But then, one day, it ended abruptly. Madoka's not here today? That sucks. She never gets sick. I wonder what happened. I heard some of the teachers talking earlier, but they said something about a meteorite. She can't come to school for a while because she had to go overseas to get treated. A meteorite? <laughs> Do they actually believe that? I had no idea how the teachers came up with that. But Madoka did stop coming to school after that day. Your little sister Madoka is so energetic. <laughs> She's a lot to handle. But that's one of the reasons why I love her. <laughs> oh, they're not talking about the Madoka I know. It's been a year since Madoka disappeared from school. But I can't help tuning my ears whenever I hear her name. Shinta, snack time! Sweetie, you're always studying. I wish you would spend more time with me. Thanks, Mom. I appreciate everything you do. Oh my gosh, she is gone. Now, I can focus on studying without anybody getting in my way. I'll get into college and have a good life. That's all I should be thinking about right now. You guys! I have a huge announcement! What is it? Answer this first. Who is the most famous person from this school? A famous person? I have no idea. I mean, a year ago, we would have answered Madoka, but she quit school. Yes, Madoka! She's back! I heard she's in one of the sophomore classes! What? Whoa, she survived getting hit by a meteorite? Guys, let's all go to her right now! Okay. Madoka! I'm so glad you're back! Are you all better now? Yep. Thanks, guys. I'm back for good. We were so worried. You left without saying anything to us. You have no idea how much we missed you, Madoka. You guys, I love you all. Shinta, you look pale. Are you feeling okay? <laughs> you should cut back on studying today. Let's hang out. Crap. Oh my gosh, I can't believe Madoka is back. Hey, but she's been gone for a year. She's in a different grade now. No, she'll definitely round up her friends to pick on me again. What if she gets the whole sophomore class to make fun of me with her? The next day, I was terrified to go to school. But I was shocked to see Madoka. She was different from the Madoka I knew. Ah, Madoka! Why do you have a baby with you? 
the meteorite was a lie, wasn't it? Were you pregnant? Madoka was holding a baby. She was trembling while her friends showered her with questions. Is it a relative's baby? Wait, are we even allowed to bring babies to school? No, right? Come to think of it, Madoka seems like the type of girl to end up like this. She got pregnant during high school. Pretty girls tend to mature faster than others. Uh, guys, this isn't what it seems. You took a year off school and returned with a baby in your arms. What other explanation is there? Shinta. <laughs> what? Why is she asking me for help? Has she forgotten what she did to me? How dare she think I would help her after what she made me go through? Shinta. Wait, um, Madoka? Is it just me? That baby is identical to Shinta. <laughs> His face and the way he laughs? It's just like Shinta. What? Me? After that, the whole school gossiped about Madoka and her baby. Hey, Shinta! I is it true? Y you and Madoka? No! That's not possible! My classmates kept making absurd accusations about me being the father of the baby. Oh my gosh! I don't know what's going on, but I can't let it slide! I'm going to see Madoka after school to find out the truth! Shinta, you better come with me! No, I want to study. And so, Miyuki, Madoka's best friend, dragged me off. You have no say in this! And forced me to visit Madoka. I thought Madoka was from a wealthy family. But her house looks shabbier than mine. Is she poor? Huh, maybe she isn't home yet. I wonder why. I heard she went home early. Hey, it's open. We went inside to find Madoka holding the baby. I changed your diaper and you had your milk. Why won't you stop crying? She was having trouble getting the baby to stop crying. Why are you here, Shinta? Uh, I have no idea. Okay, fine. This baby is my child. Just like everybody thought. I gave birth to her. I told the school and everyone around me that I got injured so I could take time off while I was pregnant. I wasn't going to tell anybody about her, but my mother got sick and is staying at the hospital. There's nobody to take care of her now. I didn't have a choice. I had to bring her to school today. Oh my gosh. I had no idea you were going through such a tough time. I'm sorry I wasn't there for you. Don't say that. I should have talked to you about it. <laughs> she's been crying nonstop. Do you think she's sick? Shinta! Mommy is here to help! Who, Who is, is that? that? Shinta. My mother. I told her to come. The baby won't stop crying, and I doubt any of us can do anything about it. My mother rushed to the baby and handled the situation like a professional. You are so sweaty. You must have been so hot. What the? Maruka is so well-mannered when she's around my mother. Gosh, I can't get over how adorable that baby was. But it wasn't what I was expecting to see. I know. I'm sorry for calling you out. I appreciate your help. Not about that. I'm talking about how the baby looks so much like you. It was like I time traveled back 17 years ago. I don't see the resemblance, but I must look like the baby if my mom says so. You know, I'm relieved. I was happy to see you have friends. She's super cute. <laughs> but why does she look like me? She's Maruka's baby. <laughs> Oh no, she must have been so upset that the baby looked like me since she hated me so much. That's why she was so exhausted and frustrated. That's why she couldn't care for the baby well. I should apologize. Not that I did anything to her. Do I have to apologize? But I'm sure she's upset that the baby looks like the guy she hated so much. I wonder who the father is. Everything about her is a mystery. When I got to Madoka's place... Yo, Madoka! How have you been? Did you receive subsidies and childcare allowance for the baby yet? Don't you think we should share the money? What the? Where have you been all this time? A man was talking to her by her door. Oh, I was out on a fishing boat to make money for the baby! Really? Then where's the money? Oh gosh, I don't have it anymore. I really need some money, you know. 
Can you get 500,000 yen ready for me? I'll come by soon to get it. Thanks, babe. I owe you one. Maruka noticed me standing outside her door with my mouth open. She immediately came running with tears flowing down her face. I... I don't expect you to believe any of this. But one day, at school, one of my friends told me that you were telling people that you hated me. It really hit me hard. I went into despair after hearing that. I went to a club. I was drinking milk when I met him. He looked just like you. I felt fulfilled when I was around him. Things were going great and I started hoping to have his baby. I've always had feelings for you, Shinta. I knew we would never end up together. That's why I hoped for a baby that looked just like you. <laughs> wow. It's been eight years since I last saw my big brother. And the way you phrase it makes it seem like you had feelings for me. Hello! My neighbors gave me some juicy apples. I brought some for you. Wow, thank you so much. Is Shinko doing alright? Yes! I thought about it hard, and I finally came to a conclusion. Madoka had feelings for me? Why did she like me? I have no friends. I'm a loner. The only thing we had in common was getting good grades. Did she think I was cute because I was frustrated that I could never beat her? So she picked on me because she didn't know how to act around me? That makes no sense! But I had to admit that Madoka was the only one in my life who ever reached out to have a connection with me. She's the only person who's ever held an interest in me. Shinko, I brought over a new toy for you! <laughs> in the end, I told Madoka I couldn't accept her feelings. There was no way I could ever like her like that. However, Shinko was family. She is my brother's daughter. Wow, I see it now. She looks just like me. <laughs> She's adorable. Madoka, you can rely on us whenever you need to. I appreciate it. Daddy, look! I can do a handstand now! <laughs> wow, that's amazing! Somehow, I ended up with Madoka. Shinko, Shita, let's have a snack. I baked a cake. Madoka never stops having feelings for me. She wasn't afraid to express it either. Shinko looked exactly like me. Seeing Madoka shower her with love made me fall in love with her deeper than I ever thought I could. When I grow up, I'm going to be just like Daddy and Mommy. I hope you will. Although Daddy didn't have many friends in high school, and your Mommy had to take many side roads to get where she wanted to, we have both become loving parents. As for my idiot brother, we couldn't get a hold of him after he left Madoka's house. We hired a detective to look for him. We found out he was locked up. He was in prison in some country overseas for dining and dashing. Still, I guess I should be thankful for his irresponsible actions. I ended up with a precious daughter and a loving wife because of him. <laughs> I guess I'll be off then. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here! We'd love to hear your thoughts too! Drop a line in the comments below! See you soon!